What's up, gang? It's your boy Ty back with another video. I got a POV today in Rambo. Gonna get some highway action going on if I can get to it. I'm about a mile away from it, but my destination 33 minutes away. I'm about to give you a good view of how it feels to drive a lifted truck. It's about eight inches off the ground, more to say nine. On 26s and 37s, 14 inch wides. It pulls great. The truck still has seemed like it hasn't lost no power since I put these tires on there. I had 35s in there before, and like you can feel the weight different differences. Like uh, when I weighed it, get my new tires all together. The tires were like 640 pounds all together, like each pair. But the 35s was like 4 430. So you can feel that difference. And like uh, I lost four miles per gallon so right now in cities i get like 11 max but usually i would get 16 15 so it's really not that bad because i barely drive it drive it anyway so but on the highways when i'm going like home usually when i had the 35 on there i would have i was getting like 2019 and it was really good because when i filled up i get like 380 max in miles but now uh, I get like 17, 16 on a good on a good drive, seven hours nonstop. I get about 320. That's enough though. <laughs> I have to fill it twice though, just to drive seven miles. I mean seven hours, but it's okay. But when I get on this highway, I'm not gonna do too much talking because I'm gonna let Rambo do the do the talking himself. I'm gonna hit that motor. I'm just leaving the barbershop, so I had to get a fresh cut. I did try to do a P POV on my way here, but I kind of fucked that up. It was my angle. I got this camera shot done right. But... <sighs> Gotta get through all these lights. Traffic doesn't look that bad right now. It's almost 5 o'clock, so I'll be running into it shortly. But we're going to move around and we're going to get the swing through traffic in a few minutes, so. Once you go dodge, you won't go back. I'm telling you, it feels like you're riding an Escalade, even on muds. You hear nothing. You don't hear no outside noise. It's nothing but just tires. It's roar. It's whistling at you, screaming at you. It's like music to my ears, though. Money well spent. I can say that. Lincoln. What are you breaking for? Ah, uh, traffic like it's slowing up. I hope not. And believe it or not, the truck still picks up quick, even with these tires on there. I feel like I'm still riding on 35s, the way I'm picking up speed. Oh yeah, I'm running in traffic there, bud. I just still gotta stay in this lane. That's crazy, man. this lane is backed up. Damn! This video is still gonna be straight though. Right now I'm at 10.5. It's been steady lately, all day. I haven't been driving as much either, but it's still steady, 10.5. I got my tire pressure sensor on. That will never go off until I get a new set of tires and then actually install the tire monitor systems. I, I didn't do it this set because I didn't think it was gonna be a big issue, but I get tired of looking at that damn light. Like any light that could pass up on this dash automatically gives me a headache because like why are you on? Even the seat, but like why are you on? Like why are you there? 
I know I don't have the seatbelt on. But I got on now because I didn't want to be thinking during the whole video. But all together is a good truck, very spacious, black on black. Can't get no better than this, dog. Very spacious. I got enough room for my iPad. I want a bigger one. I'm gonna. Well, I have a bigger one, but it's not cellular, so. If I can make it cellular, then that's going to get replaced because that actually comes in handy when you're watching movies on long trips. You get tired of listening to music or you run out on your playlist. You got that for backup. And that kills a whole lot of time too. You get through like three movies, you already at your destination. And then the surround sound in here, oh my, it got like two modes. You got standard and surround sound in here. So you feel like you're in a theater for real. I think everybody's going to Orlando. This is Orlando's traffic. I think they're sliding to Tampa. They are sliding in Tampa. That's where I need to be. I'm in the wrong side, car. Stuck if I stayed in the line. Come on, get over. This ain't no scat. They got hips and thighs on this hell cat. Wide body. Now listen, that Celine Fran Big Three, that shit hard as hell. You can just hear the tires roar. That's all you're gonna hear is the tires, nothing else, just tire and asphalt. Tire and asphalt, that's all you need to hear. Roar, 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 roar. I really don't mind it. I don't mind it at all, actually. That shit sounds good as hell. Now, if you stop hearing it, you just need to get new tires. You go ahead and get new tires. And that's the problem. It is a nice day right now. It was, did look ugly before or earlier. Partly cloudy in that motherfucker. Got some on my side. three to five more miles an hour than what you regularly see on your dash. So it says I'm going 64, but really I'm probably going 69 or damn near 70. So you just gotta calibrate in your system. You gotta get one of them sensor uh, and calibration. I forgot what, I don't know what they call it, like a tuner. It's in a tuner, I know that for a fact. But that's another issue. But you know, Florida's not really big on stopping you for speeding. Unless you're going like 20 plus over the fucking mile speed limit, but they really don't give a fuck. Like, I was supposed to change my fucking license plate, like, damn near a year ago, and it's still, I'm not even gonna say it, but it's still the way it is right now, and I had, I had a lot of police behind me, and they did not fuck with me at all. They chill over here. Like, in Florida, South Carolina, they chill. Chill as hell. But once you get to damn Georgia, you are fucked, because they gonna fuck with you. Them boys don't play. I got pulled over going 10 miles over the speed limit. What the fuck? And then they double back on my ass with the ticket. One of $200 more because they call me a super speeder. What kind of bullshit is that? Speed traps. That fucker's huge.
try to squeeze through here. We got it. Oh, that car's coming over too. Now I can get over. She really had to ride away because she was ahead of me. About like five fucking inches. Make sure you watch them blind spots. You gotta be aware of them motherfuckers. That big car is right next to you, you won't even know. Won't even know. The car's going off the road. <clears throat> I might see something extravagant. I'm not hoping no crash or anything, but the moment you have the camera up, you don't see nothing. But the moment you put that damn camera down, you see everything. I just seen so much shit. I'm missing my visor up there. I never put them back in when I was installing my starlights. Two, two, seven, three. How's my driving? Fuck it. I think it's like a lawyer's car or some shit. Like a promoter's vehicle. But yeah, like I was saying, first POV in Rambo. Like and comment what you think I should do next. Still giving out some. I need some more ideas. If you like this video, comment in videos. Comment in the sections, you know what I mean? I done mix and mangled all that shit up. And I'll drop more POVs and Rambo. Might have something different by then, but still more POVs and Rambo. Think about something else. Think about something bigger. You know, big motor. No diesel shit, though. I can't do no diesel. I don't need nothing with diesel. 
I don't be pulling nothing. I'm not pulling nothing. I don't need no damn diesel truck. But yeah, like, comment. Tell me what you think. POV and Rambo. Bumper to bumper up here. I mean, once you get through these little four, uh, four exits right here, it just clears the hell up. Well, just to uh, just to uh, Ocala, but you go to St. Pete, fucking downtown, it's packed as hell. Bumper to bumper whole way. My back, I'm going to get over. I'm gonna slow down for you. There you go. I think I'm kind of nice on the highway. It all depends on where the hell I'm going. Cause some, some people could be a fucking asshole for no reason, dog. And then you got some people that just had their fucking blinkers on and just, just be waiting to get over and they can see a big ass gap and slowly get the fuck over. Like, nah, get your ass all the way over. I gotta go over now, actually. I'm gonna slide over. I gotta just slide over and have it. I'm getting off the highway and it's gonna be probably bumper to bumper again so make sure you like comment and subscribe i will have another pov soon but i got another video to drop i got a few more videos i gotta drop that i already made so far so just stay stay tuned and keep up with your boy and we out gang